good morning children of class 2 from today onwards we will start the chapters for the annual term or the final terms okay and today we will start about animals okay children uh, we can found the different varieties of animals from uh, all or all around us and children pets like uh, animals like uh, dogs and cats that we will keep in our homes and well as some animals like cow and ho uh, hens uh, are also stay near to our homes these animals we are called domestic animals and the tiger wolves lion all these they will lives in a jungles and we call them as an wild animals okay <coughs> animals like zebra and elephant to okay, children zebra and elephants are the land animals while fish and whales live under water and some animals like crocodile and frogs lives on both land as well as the water okay and animals like monkey lives in a water, uh, in a tree while birds and insect uh, they can fly in about air but uh birds um, uh, they make their homes or uh, make their nest in trees okay children and the children so what animals eat animals unlike plants that can make their own food children we have already discussed in the previous class that a plant make their own food whereas animals need to find food to eat and uh because animals cannot make their own food okay so uh, animals like some animals like uh, um, eat uh, others animals uh, and they eat uh, deer cows uh, uh, and pa uh, plants uh, plants parts while some animals like lion and shark eat uh both the uh, fle uh, sorry um, the flesh of other animals okay children's animals uh, are uh, animals need to find food to eat so some animals like deer and cow eat pl uh, plants okay uh, some animals like uh, lion and shark and tiger they will eat the flesh of other animals means they will eat the muscles and the bones of the other animals okay and uh, children uh, some animals like uh, crow bears and yes of course we human also eat both plants and as well as the flesh of the other animals means we can eat both the um, plants and the flesh of the other animals okay children so flesh eaters animals are like flesh eaters means the animals who can eat only flesh or the muscles of the other animals are like this wolf spider and shark okay and children's animals that eat both plant as well as the flesh of other animals are like a bear a crow and we human being or the man okay children and cow and goats a graze on the grass while giraffe eats the leaves that grow on the tall trees children we can see that this uh, cow cow and goats graze on the grass uh, grass uh, grass means a cow and goat uh, where every time they were uh, searching for the uh, grass means graze grass means uh, uh, they want to be they feed themselves the grass of the field okay and whereas giraffe uh, loves to eat the tall uh, trees grasses because their necks are also long so they uh, loves to eat or they always are uh, searching for the uh, tall trees grass okay and children frogs catches insect frogs catches insect with their long tails means this frog catches insect with they will uh, with their tongue uh, a long tongue okay and while a snake often swallow while big children uh, this uh, uh, snake uh, mostly swallow a uh, whole uh, uh, frog by, uh, from uh, uh, sorry uh, snake often swallow this uh, whole frog okay and uh, birds like uh, pigeons and sparrow eat uh, grains while king kingfishers and cranes eat fly uh, fry, uh, fish okay 
kingfisher and cranes eat fish whereas uh, sparrow pigeons they will eat uh, grains okay and woodpecker eat uh, insect while the peacock even eats snakes okay and children how do animals move these are the um, uh, things that uh, children uh, animals will eat how they will uh, their eating habits what are the things that they want to eat but children uh, how animals moves we can discuss okay and uh, different animals have their different parts like we will move with by our foot okay and different animals have different parts that helps it to move about in the places where they lives most uh, land animals have legs like us we also have a legs we will move from our legs by walking and running place where it where we want to go okay and most uh, land animals also have their legs and they will walk and run by their foot or from uh, from, uh, from any dangers they can if they can realize they are having an any uh, dangers so they will run by their foot okay or by their legs a deer run on uh, four legs okay children so this the deer can run with their four uh, legs when uh, they will realize or they can find uh, any dangers okay and uh, like this kangaroos kangaroos will jump by their two legs okay jump on their two uh, legs okay and whereas the tails of the monkey helps them to climb and hold on the branches of a tree okay and insects some insects have mostly most insects have uh, six legs while a spider have eight and centipedes have many more we cannot count how many legs the centipedes have okay and snakes and earthworm they don't have their legs so they only crawl on the uh, land okay and children's birds can uh, fly with the help of their uh, wings and insect also about in the air with the fly, fly with their wings okay while fleas, uh, fishes will be swim in water by their fins and dogs have a webbed feet okay children ducks uh, have their way feet with uh, with a uh, uh, skin between their toes it helps them to paddle uh, through water and they can walk also in both uh, sorry in both uh, in uh, land also and they can paddle they they can use their uh, feet as a paddle in the water also okay and children uh, there are many animals we can use and we can keep in our homes like different animals we will keep and some animals are very useful for us okay and children uh, man has uh, kept uh, many animals for their use and to build them to home homes uh, which we can keep in uh, near from our homes okay like hens and ducks we will keep in our homes as they gives us eggs and uh, eggs as well as cow and buffalo we will keep for to that as they gives us milk and milk is used to proceed to many milk products like butter cheese ice cream ghee etc okay and children we also keep bees as we can make their small small ho uh, wooden ho homes that we will keep uh, near to our homes as bees gives us honey and we also kept uh, goat and chickens uh, as we eaten as an meat okay and children the uh, woolen clothes that we wear and we use blankets and other woolen clothes that all their their this uh, wool will be we will get from the sheep okay and the wool uh, the fur of the uh, sheep as used to make and they will uh, used to make a blankets and other woolen clothes and silk sarees mostly you heard children that the silk sarees that silk will comes from the an insect that is called the silk worm okay 
and children's uh, some uh, the some animals skins we use to as a uh, leather for uh, shoes belts and bags okay and uh, beast burden means uh, uh the animals which they carried which you we used to carry loads uh, or weight for us like horse and bull uh, we used to draw cart while mules and donkeys are uh, used to carry weights and men also ride a horse and a camel to travel from uh, place to place okay children